Hey, what's up? It's Sugar from Sound Candy Studio. Uh, today I'm going to take a look at my top 10 audio interfaces of 2020. Okay, we'll get straight into this one. Right, so there is a criteria I'm going to be using to do this video. It's going to be popularity based on usage, build quality, industry feedback, value for money, and how good is this thing straight out of the box? That is all we're going to we're going to do with this one. Okay, so let's not waste any more time. I'm gonna try and get this done in under seven minutes. In at number 10, we have the SSL 2 Plus. Two in, two out, no MIDI, two headphones. Uh, maximum sample rate on this is 192. Large rotary encoder, five stage segment LEDs, 4K, uh, which is modeled on the SSL 4000. This is great for project work, great for studio work. Definitely should check this one out. In at number nine, we have Complete Audio 2. If you're staying within an ecosystem, then Native Instruments is a great ecosystem. This has two in, two out, one headphone socket, a maximum sample rate of 192, entirely USB powered, a street price is about 89 pounds. It's a great product for a first timer. In at number eight, you have the Behringer UMC404 HD. This is a four in, four out, has MIDI, one headphone socket, maximum sample rate on this is 192. It's USB, it's rough street price is about 89 pounds. If you're just about starting into a music career, this is a great product to have, well built. Take a look at this one. In at number seven, we have the 18i20. This is the Focusrite Scarlet. It has 10 in, eight out, has MIDI, two headphone sockets, a maximum sample rate of 192, switchable air functions, eight mic pre's, ADA, SPDIF. This is a wonderful product. It's also rack mountable, so this is definitely something you need to check out. Current street price on this is about 329 pounds. In at number six, we have the Steinberg UR22C. This is two in, two out, it has MIDI, headphone socket, 24 bit, 192 kilohertz on the maximum sample rate, USB three, uh, optional power supply, rough street price on this is about 111 pounds. This has DSP supported uh, monitoring, uh, mix control, mono switches, 24 bit trigger. This is a great product for someone who's just starting out in the music business. We've reached our halfway point, so in at number five, we have the Focusrite Scarlet 18i8 3rd Gen. This has 24-bit, uh, 192 kilohertz maximum sample rate, four Scarlet preamps, phantom power, switchable air function, four mic pre's under XLR 6.3, Four line inputs, four line outputs, balance jack, two stereo headphones, ADAT, MIDI, SPDIF, USB-C. This is a great product uh, also for Mac and PC and comes bundled with a huge amount of software to get you going. So if you're just in the music business or you're stepping your, your game up, this is a wonderful product and it's in at number five. Coming in at number four, we have the PreSonus AudioBox i2. It's a two in, two out, it does have MIDI, one headphone socket, it has a maximum sample rate of 96, which is probably more uh, than most of you are going to need. Uh, I generally record at 48 or 44. This is USB 2, it's iPad, Mac and PC compatible. At the time of recording this, you can also get yourself a premium uh, Studio One add-on bundle and you can also sign up for a Nimbit account, but you will need to sign up for that. This is a wonderful addition if you want to stay within the ecosystem and it is great for a first timer because it only comes in at roughly about 84 pounds at the time of recording this. In at number three, we have the RME Five Face UCX. Now, RME are a German company, so you know this is this thing is built very, very well. It's a 36 channel USB 2 and Firewire 400 interface. In terms of analog inputs, it has eight. It also supports ADAT, SPDIF, and it obviously has MIDI. In terms of total sample rate, this is 24 bit 192. It sports also sync check, sync align, steady clock, digi check, and total. Mix. And in terms of class compliant, this is class compliant, so you can use this across your iPad and iPad 2. Uh, again, links in the description for this also. 
Well, we're almost there. We're at number two, and this is hat. Well, it had to be Universal Audio Apollo Twin. Now, I love these products, but I don't own one. Okay, so what is this thing sporting? It's sporting 24-bit, 192 maximum sample rate. This is the A to D converter. It has a phantom power supply, two microphone line input combos. This is the 6.3 millimeter jack. It also sports a high Z instrument line input that is 6.3 two line outputs, two monitor outputs, ADAT, SPDIF, stereo uh, headphone jack, which is a 6.3, and the one on screen, uh, it's USB-C, but it also supports Thunderbolt 3. Uh, it also has this uh, UAD2 dual core uh, processor that gives you latency-free recording. This this product is just wonderful. It's also bundled with a huge amount of software, so you'll definitely need to check this one. Well, we're finally here. My number one pick for 2020 for the audio interface has to go to Focusrite. Shout out Focusrite. This is the Scarlett 2i2 third gen. It's a two channel USB audio interface with USB-C. It supports 24 bit 192 kilohertz on the maximum sample rate and it supports their beautiful Scarlett microphone preamps. It also supports a phantom power switchable air mode two mic line inputs uh, that's under the XLR and the 6.3 uh, combo jacks, stereo headphone jack on the front that's 6.3, USB connection and it's Mac and PC compatible. What else can I say? That's my top end for 2020. So let me know what you think. Uh, please like, uh, share, subscribe and certainly comment. If I've missed something that you think should have been in there, feel free to tell me. Uh, that's it for me for now. So take care. Goodbye.